Freaking brilliant. Run to get your tickets. And I'm not even saying that because I love Theater Huntsville. I don't believe this particular family are entirely aware of why they found such an agreeable price for the property. Let's suppose they know that aspect of it, do they? And let's suppose someone were to inform them of those facts. Let's say that were to happen. Because I think that would be an interesting conversation to have. Well, I tell you what, you go ahead and you do whatever it is you think you need to do. But right now, you're going to take yourself through that door. And I have a house. responsibility to the community as a whole. I can't afford to simply pursue my own selfish interests. Uh, I've been in love with uh, Clyburn Park for years. Uh, this is one of the best scripts that I've ever had the. Uh, great uh, luck to work on. This is a extraordinary piece of theater that is uh, both timely, uh, witty, uh, funny, and uh, something that's very important, important for us to be talking about as a community right now. And I'm very glad to have the chance to bring this to our community. I was telling the joke. See? Uh, you told me, remind me what joke. In, in, but, but now I'm not allowed to tell it? Stop a second. <laughs> Anyway, you gotta start this jail. Like, I'm sorry, I don't mean to keep interrupting anyone, but can someone please explain to me what it is we are doing here? I said I absolutely love this set because it goes from just being this amazing little home that you know you're moving out of to being this rundown place, and it's it's a transition that you don't really get to see a lot in theater where one set has a completely different face, two faces of one show. But the, the actors were phenomenal. They were on point and they were realistic and you felt their their passions and you felt their devastations and you felt their anger and you felt their frustrations. Look, I'm not gonna stand around while you and Jim have conversations you about being, matters. You're being ugly. Well, matters, I don't like ugly. the memory of me and my son. And furthermore, if you insist on doing that on your own time, if that gives you some kind of comfort, then what is wrong with comfort? Are we not allowed any comfort anymore? When I kid, I didn't have a lot of comfort, did he? He 